Um, there was also a little bit of a debate I saw once we were talking about dinosaurs mm -hmm. about um, are we talking about millions of years or thousands of years when it comes to dinosaurs, creationism, all of that. Depends on how you interpret the Bible. And I'll, again, I'll give you a real short, concise answer. You can go a lot deeper than this. Answersingenesis.org is another great resource for this. Depends on if you interpret the Bible, the book of Genesis in particularly, literally or not. Mm. I <laughs> interpret it literally. Yeah. The, the book of Genesis doesn't, it, it's not written poetically. It's not, it doesn't seem to be written as though, like w one of the arguments is, is it a, an actual 24 hour day mm. that, that it was created, you know, seven days of creation, were they each 24 hours or were they longer? Nowhere in scripture are we led to believe that it's anything other than a day, like mm -hmm. we know it to be. Yeah. Could it have been? I guess. I would have, I would think God would tell us that if that were the case. So the way I read it is God created all of heaven and earth and all the animals in seven literal days, six literal days and took the seventh day off. Right. And so when it comes to uh, the, the time span of earth, we believe in a very young earth around 10,000 years, not millions, Most. not billions, yeah. because you can trace humanity back to the very beginning <laughs> through the book of Genesis. And again, there's a lot of other deep conversation that we could get into about that. But if you're asking if I believe if uh, the, the earth and dinosaurs were around thousands or millions or billions, I lean toward thousands. <laughs>